don't know you like that to be talking about. I just be fucking with your sex and red. She said, no, but she be really shit. No, you be talking about, she said, no, man, I don't mean it like that. Uh, what do you say about her? Uh, that it look like her, you know, she, she let a lot of people fuck with no rebels. But that's what she said, though. That she had she said, said that. It? Yeah, she said that. Oh, so she did it to herself? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, she said, why you be talking about me? Nah, I mean, I'm just a comedian, just use, you know, a celebrity for good content and topic. Uh, it's really nothing personal, uh, unless they make it personal. Yeah. Yeah, shout out to like Sexy that. Red. B.I. hate Aiden Ross fucked her. <laughs> uh, but she did, she came back and said he paid for the pussy and oh. took his virginity. Uh, and, and he always wanted to Did fuck a black girl. Pussy? No, I don't no. think ain't nothing wrong with okay. selling pussy. Pussy should always be for sale. Pussy should never be for free. Really? Never be for free. What? Yeah, as hard as it used to be to get pussy, pussy should never be for free. It, it's, it, it's, it's, it's much less appreciated if it gets gotten for free. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And every, and every year, and, and, and every year uh, uh, the price of pussy is supposed to increase like inflation and taxes. I'm not bullshitting. Well, no. That's an idea. I'm, I'm telling you. Mine. Yeah, man, make pussy expensive again. Oh, that yeah, that, that way, that way, that way guys who aren't really hell of a guys can't be hell of a guys. The only reason guys are hell of a guy because they can kind of get pussy a little easy now. Yeah, back in my day, it was hard for guys to get pussy, especially so, fat guys. So how much should pussy be worth? Uh, 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 at least rent, a uh, rent and light bill. So, so, so the first time you get some pussy, uh, you're supposed to be at least be willing to pay half a rent. Okay. What if she's like a streamer and got like a high light bill? Uh, you should be willing to pay for her. Her, her, her most least expensive uh, desire, whether that's a ring, uh, a, a vacation, a trip, or something like that. But my mother always said, uh, son, you don't go over to no a woman's house and open her refrigerator. Because when you open her refrigerator, you're using electricity. She said, when you go over a woman's house and you flush that woman's toilet, nigga, you done use some water. You wash your hand, you done run up the water bill. So you be less, so you be less than a man not to be willing to contribute something to that woman's house and you over there fucking up her utilities and she giving you some pussy? Damn. Yeah, you're a rotten motherfucker if you don't give her nothing. <laughs> yeah, nigga. Number dick. Yeah, yeah, you gonna be problems. I like your mama. Yeah, I do too. Yeah, she raised the hell of a <laughs> Yeah, <head>. I do too. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. She definitely raised the hell out of you. So speaking of Aiden Ross, he denied uh, a Boosie interview because he didn't want to involve you. Oh, um, you still hate him? Well, 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 you know, we, we made up. Yeah, yeah, we made up after we fell out. But but he, he had called me. Uh-huh. And, and so he, he wanted to he wanted to put me in Boosie. So he had been trying to get me to sit down with Boosie. Mm-hmm. Uh, they want to squash the beef. But it ain't no real beef. But they want to squash the beef, so let's squash the beef. So, uh, yeah, he had called me and said, uh, man, Boosie want to do, you know, want to do a stream. Would you be willing to do it with me so y'all can squash the beef? And I was like, man, yeah, yeah, I'd do it for you, nephew. Man, hell yeah. Uh, but Boosie then wasn't willing to. So, uh, so, 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 since he didn't want to do it with me, uh, you know, I guess I, I, uh, yeah, man, he turned his ass down. Good for him. Vlad turned me down for Boosie. So yeah, uh, it, 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 yeah, Vlad turned me down for Boosie. So you know, or uh, not that it's a tit for tat thing, but getting all them good interviews. Uh, yeah, yeah. I like couch confessions though. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm not like cat confession. Or in there over the line on a lot of that shit. Hmm. How about Dre and Michelle getting pregnant by a whole 22 year old that she has a kid the same age as? Yeah, that's an old that's an old hoe that done got a young trick. Yeah, that happens a lot in life, and that's a sad situation. Mm. Yeah, yeah, How do you young. Feel about that age uh, gap. Oh uh, well, uh, uh, I, I respect the age gap. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in for hoes catching young, you know, young niggas and like that. The other way around, or uh, cool I, I, that? I'm cool with the other way around. Uh, see, I, I, I come from an era mm-hmm. where as long as they coming out of high school, they grown. Hmm. So, so there was a point in time when, when, when the NBA used to draft high school players out, out of high school and take their ass straight to the pros. Now, think about this. They take 18-year-old, 19-year-old high school students and put them in an arena with pros. Hmm. Why a hoe can't do it? A wild man can't do it looking for a young yeah, hoe. That's the fence. Yeah, yeah, wild man can't do it yeah, looking for a young hoe. Because I can groom this motherfucker to be what I need him to be. Okay. 
Okay. In young, dumb, and full of cum. Mm-hmm. So the life source of old versus young is if an old man fuck a young woman, he gets the, he gets the energy source of putting his dick in that young pussy, and he be vibrant and young, and his skin be glowing like a pregnant hoe, and he can do jumping jacks and push up and all kind of shit. But the old man is fucking a woman his age, he get ulcers and, and, and uh, colon cancer, and yeah, high blood pressure. He be miserable in the motherfucker fucking them old hoes. Oh my God. Nah, man, you live hell now. Nah. You want to stay young and live forever? Granddad said, boy, you gonna put your dick in a young fountain. Same with the old hoes. If the old hoes want to be vibrant and look how they look, man, you drank from that young fountain. So, yeah, so why that- not... Yeah, drinking from the phone and having a whole baby by them. And well, but having a whole baby by is one of the most ingenious methods that you can come up with because now I get to secure this pussy forever. If nothing else, this nigga gonna be paying like Britney Renner. Britney Renner got a 40 baby by the 40 minutes. You know how much that baby gonna get? If this nigga died in the car wreck, guess who get all the money? The baby. So why not have a baby by this nigga? It's called Ching Ching. What is you talking about, man? Man, 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 It's Ching Ching for the bit for the old bitch that got the young rich nigga. She winning, cause no matter what, he go take care of the baby either by choice or by force. He go take care of that baby, and guess who get to reap the benefits of him taking care of the baby? That old pussy. <laughs> That old pussy, and she get to run circles around him. She get to be his mama, because guess what? Most niggas looking for their mama anyway when they dating. Baby, can you do this for me? Yeah. Baby, can you do this? Baby, can you watch? So she get to play mama and baby mama. She winning like a motherfucker. Who mad at her but a hoe who can't do it? And a bitch who mad because she stuck in a rut, in a situation. She, man, mo ho got, man, please. She got a rich baby daddy. Well, for me, I'm proud of that. I got a little sister that was born in '92, so I can't go anywhere near '90 anything. It's just weird. Motherfucker, 18. What do the law say? <laughs> I'm looking. Man, most the law say, says 18. Say most motherfuckers looking for their woman to be dumber than them anyway. Most most people are looking for the upper hand in a relationship or any situation. Most people are looking to be in an inferior inferior position. I mean, a superior position, position, right? Mm-hmm. So if you dating younger, chances are you dating to be able to kind of manipulate, have your way, groom, you coach. Uh, uh, I'm married to an older woman. Oh, yeah? She's 52, I'm 46. Oh. Yeah, I'm married to an older woman. She got you locked in? No, hell no. <laughs> Shit, no. Hell no. I ain't locked in to no book thing. So but my own good. On I'm only locked in to my, we're only locked in to our desires. Mm. Look, can't no woman like no man in. He's locked in to his desires. Hmm. I'm learning a lot from you today. Yeah, 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 it, it, it's it's every woman's desire to conquer the beast in the man. Mm. So the old woman, the older woman, typically thinks she done conquered the younger man because she's older than him. Uh, the older man who dates the younger woman uh, typically thinks he's conquered her, and the older the younger woman thinks she's conquered the older man through sex. Yeah, but if he ain't got no goddamn money, he's just in a compromised position.